children today i am teaching science subject so today our topic name is our wonderful body so second class children you already in learned that in the previous class our body so here our wonderful body our body body our body full body wonderful body so slight different is there so first of all you have to observe your body you have body no uh, all members have a wonderful body once you have to go and stand in front of mirror you have to observe your face your body structures do this all children you have to do this afterwards you have to observe your uh, body in front of your mirror okay first you have to when you are observing your face what you are observing in your face do you have yes do you have eyes do you have nose do you have lips do you have teeth do you have tongue yes all of you have all body parts so all members have how many hands are there say children two hands how many legs are there two legs so uh, in the previous class we are discussing about the sense organs no uh, you have to give the uh, answers how many sense organs are there say children yes how many sense organs are there five sense organs what is that eyes ears nose tongue and skin so these all are five important sense organs look at this picture children have you observed this what is this see here what is this this is the head uh, especially here also given see once you have to observe this is the head this is the face this is total we are saying head next what is this this is the eye here i draw also given next this is the ear next this is the nose so this is the chest this is the stomach so here lips here teeth here tongue inside tongue also have no ah that is the tongue next this is the palm this is the palm this is the thumb what is this this is the thumb so here what is this these all are fingers in uh, corner what we are observing nails also have in this picture here nails also given this is the thumb these all are fingers so here also see the structure on oh, our body a structure this is the head eyes nose lips what is this this is the neck what is this this is the chest this is the stomach or belly okay uh, next this is the waist waist means uh, this uh, here looking uh, this is the waist next uh, here thighs here legs uh, what is this this is the foot uh, so in this fingers have no foot fingers we are calling toes so foot fingers we are calling toes these all are what you are observing body parts but we are seeing this body parts these all are body parts looking here outside looking so these all are external body parts so if these all are oh, body parts are another name what organs so body parts another name organs so organs is the very very important so organs are two types internal organs external organs so these all are external organs when we are seeing outside it is looking outside means these all are called uh, external organs internal organs means what do you observe your brain do you observe your heart do you see your heart do you see your brain do you see your stomach inside stomach do you see your lungs no we can't see you are, you are not each and every one we can't see why because these all are internal organs we can't see we are uh, the brain covered with our skull our head so we can't see the brain next uh, uh, what is this heart our heart also covered with our chest so that is uh, our heart also we can't see so how many uh, internal organs are there four first one what is the brain brain spelling what ma b r a i n brain say to the all of you brain b r a i n brain say to you b r a i n brain second one what ma second one what heart heart spelling h e a r t heart spelling say to all of you h e a r t heart third one lungs third one what ma lungs l u n g s lungs fourth one stomach 
S D O M D A C H stomach. These all are internal organs. Internal organs. We can't see these organs. But the main important part, part in our body, brain. Uh, so when you are thinking something means the brain is the very very important. Without brain we can't live. Or we can't think anything. Uh, when we are doing some works, we are eating, we are playing, we are writing, uh, doing some works. How can we do the works? The brain will give the order. You have to write, you have to eat. Like that the brain gives to us orders. Then we have to do some works. The brain thinking, oh, uh, this answer is this. Uh, when you are uh, listening the question means uh, immediately you are giving the answer no matter how can you giving this answer the brain thinking that answer then only you have to write that otherwise you are giving that answer so all functions uh, in the very very important part all functions we are doing so many works so many uh, things so the main important part in our body the brain so who will protect the brain Guess the answer. Who will protect the brain? Skull. Our head protects the brain. Our head only protects the brain. Our head inside only brain having no. So in our brain three important parts are there. Cerebrum, cerebellum, medulla. So you are uh, uh, learning higher classes this total information. So main important part in our body. Internal body part. What is that? Brain. So, brain is the very very important part. So, the head protects the skull. Inside the skull also have the skull or head protects the brain. When some person going back um, uh, one place to another, uh, he is moving with your uh, with uh, his bike. Means uh, he, he will not uh, wear the helmet. Means suddenly uh, accident will occur. Means he will fell down. Uh, accident will occur. What happened? When he fell down, he injured his head. When he wear the helmet means he can't uh, injure. So, uh, safety purpose nowadays, especially uh, police officers strictly warned. Uh, without a helmet, uh, we can't move. When we are moving without helmet means they are uh, uh, taking fine also. So, we have to protect ourselves. So, always we have to wear the helmet. So next uh, heart. Heart is also most one of the most important part in our uh, internal part. What is that heart? Uh, see here children, uh, where is your heart? You have to observe. This is our body. Where is your heart? This is the heart. This is the heart. This is the heart. Where is your heart? You have to observe. This is the right side. This is the left side. Which side is there your heart? Say. Once you have to think and say. Yes. Left side. Left side is your heart is there. In which side do you know? Uh, how much space will take your heart? Uh, yes. Each and every person. Right hand. Uh, fist. Uh, you have to uh, open your right hand. You have to open your hand. You have to close. Uh, like this you have to close your hand. This is called a fist. So every person right hand fist. You have to uh, keep your heart left side. Uh, each and every person heart size only that person's fist only. So when you have to keep your hand like this. This uh, size only have your heart. Each and every one heart also same like that only have. So when you are observing that uh, uh, keep your uh, hand in your uh, heart means you have to listen some sound coming. Do you observe? What is that sound? Lub dub, lub dub, lub dub. Have you heard the sound? You have to do it. All members, all children have to do like this. Listen the song. S. Lab dub. Lab dub. Listening no? Mm. So, that is the our heartbeat. Heartbeat. We have to say like that uh, uh, songs coming no? So, we are saying that is the heartbeat. Lab dub. Lab dub. So, uh, that uh, heart, uh, 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 when you are uh, 
uh, suddenly sometimes we are uh, sick we we are falling ill uh, or uh, we are sick means uh, we went to the hospital uh, in that hospital doctors uh, what they are doing doctor uh, what he is doing he have to wear the stethoscope and he have to observe the heartbeat so that is called the stethoscope so stethoscope i have to say the pronunciation of stethoscope beta s t e t h o stethoscope s c o p e stethoscope you observing the here uh, uh, yes uh, they are wearing and he is observing like this lab dab lab dab he can hear the sounds of our heart so he will say that our heart functioning how is our heart uh, uh, how is our temperature so he will give the treatment so uh, heart is the very important one of the most important part in our body so in the uh, heart will the blood heart will pumps blood to uh, each and every part heart will pumps blood to each and every part so heart is the one of the most important part in our body parts internal parts so especially you have to observe that today we are discussing two topics okay brain and heart first of all you have to draw the picture of the heart, brain first you have to draw the picture of the brain see the children all of you have to slowly take your notebook and pencil slowly you have to uh, draw this outline of the brain like this afterwards you have to take like this here you have to draw leaf like that Leaf. How is the leaf? Same like that. Only you have to draw this picture. Okay. Ah, uh, this very slowly clouds. Clouds model. You have to draw. Clouds model. You have to draw slowly. Like this. This is the brain. so uh, in this uh, main important this or uh, this part we are calling cerebrum this is the main intelligence main part in our uh, uh, brain intelligent part what is that intelligent part means cerebrum this is the cerebellum this is the medulla we will discuss in uh, higher classes so heart heart and brain is two important internal parts of the body so uh okay uh you have to read that uh, uh have you understand this uh, lesson children today only we are discussing two topics only okay tomorrow we will discuss lung and stomach also so uh, today i am giving homework so you have to do that uh, homework what is that homework text book page number 162 You have to read this lesson and you have to write down the hard words only. Huh? Uh, read the homework textbook page number one sixty two. Read the lesson and write the hard words. Read the lesson and write the hard words. You have to observe the hard words. Write the hard words. See the children are already in this textbook. Some hard words given like this black dark. Uh, they are given no black dark color. They stressed that special words. You have to write that words. Okay, children. 